Welcome to the LDS Mental Health Podcast. This is a podcast for faithful women who want healing in their relationships, guidance from God, and internal peace. Each week, you'll hear mental health concepts taught through a spiritual lens from me, a licensed clinical mental health counselor, to help you start thinking in a higher and holier way. Welcome back to the 12 Days of Christ Connections. We are on day 11 of identifying strategies to make long-lasting connections with the Savior. Build your relationship with Him. Today's Christ Connection is to build the skill of noticing your senses. You might be thinking, what in the world, Nikki? What do my senses have to do with connecting with Christ? Well, a lot. If you think about it, you came to this earth to get a body, right? Your body must be an essential part of the plan of salvation. Your body is what helps you experience this world. You experience this world because of your senses. Think about it. You know that you're sitting where you're sitting because of your senses. Without them, you wouldn't know what was even happening around you. They must be pretty powerful, right? Also, there's a ton of research about using your senses to to decrease stress in your mind and body. And some people call that skill grounding, but I like to call it a connecting tool. When you notice and become aware of your senses, you are connecting your mind and your body. Also, you're connecting your spirit to your body. You are allowing yourself to be in an optimal state to hear the spirit. Your mind and body are at their quietest and can hear the still small voice of the spirit converting messages from the savior to you. This is another skill to be developed. So I would suggest picking an activity to practice it with each day, like maybe brushing your teeth. You could just notice how the ground feels underneath your feet, how the toothpaste tastes. You could notice sounds around you or even just how gravity feels on your body. Try to stay in tune with at least one sense and make a goal of doing that for the duration of the activity. Each day, you can see if you can stay in tune with your senses for just a little bit longer each day. This is another skill I cover in depth in my LDS Mental Health Skills membership. If you want to learn more, you can click the link in my show notes and get on the wait list. All right, tomorrow is our last day of Christ Connections. See you tomorrow. Thank you for listening to the LDS Mental Health Podcast. I hope you were able to find ways of healing, guidance, and peace. If you liked this episode, please share it with a friend who would love to start thinking in a higher and holier way as well. Or hit that follow button so you don't miss out on any episodes. Also, check out the links in my show notes for other episodes you might like and links for other mental health resources on my website.